Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Mr. Recon here with your weekly update video for you guys. Today, ladies and gentlemen, we got a new girl coming out next week because we got entry exam this week. And we got the new Elsa girl uh, for Cosmo that just came out. And we have a new skin for Nymphira. So, we also have Lovely Journey. But before we get into the rest of the video, if you're new to the channel, please subscribe. Your support's really appreciated. Let me smash that like button. Leave a comment down below on what you think of this week's events. Or just if you have a question in the game in general. Also, I encourage you to join the Discord. That way you can get excellent help in the Discord. Plenty of people in there talking about the game. If you want to learn stuff about the game, the link to my Discord is in the description down below. Now, ladies and gentlemen, we have Nympera, new skin. I, I like the skin, but she's obviously not useful in the game per se. Um, so you shouldn't be really trying to actively go after her. But the skin is nice. I, I do have to say that. So... The event times are going to be from the 26th to the 1st, September 1st. That, that would be the 25th through the 31st for me, right? August has 31 days. Yes. So remember, if you're day behind, you're day behind. The other words are going to be four wheels, 150 gems, four bottles of um, plain bottles, but it's bottles of drift is the event, and then two lucky dips coins. First up, we'll start with um, Lovely's Journey. So um, this is where we take Lovely, which... Um, goes around the board, which is Capsule Girl's pet, by the way, if you don't know. Capsule Girl's a very old girl. She used to be good back in the day, but not anymore. Besides the point, um, she goes around the board. Um, she starts here, if you see my little cursor, and you go all the way to the right, down, left, and then back up. Do not want to land on the Whirlpool. It cuts your moves in half. If you do land on it, do not use your advance wheel. Just use a normal spin. If you don't know what that is, advance wheel on the left, you have to land on the advance wheel on the board to get it, and then the normal wheel, you could just use Milly Nelly, just as much as you want. The key here to know is once you get the advanced wheel, what you want to do is on this side of the board, starting at this one, because it's a six to here, um, six, four, three, two, and one to get to the advanced wheel. You just use an advanced wheel to get another advanced wheel. It's essentially a free move around the board. So I'll do that once you get it. Also, your goal is to level up the corals. There's three of them. They go to level three. They go from three to four to five, essentially. You want them to all be five. Free to play, you get 78 wheels. Um, 20 from exclusive tasks, 28 from logging in, and 30 from buying from gems. I always tell you to save gems every, every, all the time for this and uh, tech innovation to get your class sets. So, right now we got some pearls going on, which you don't know what the pearls were. They're at the corners of the board, if you see them right here, 10 and 15, one of them. Chizuku is there. If you can get a Chizuku copy and you get 300, kudos to you. Go ahead and grab that. It's pretty good. Um, otherwise, you're definitely going to do the servant crystals. May you might not ask, or may you may ask, why I always grab several servant crystals first. It's because all core on the servants is extremely important, especially if you're new to the game. That really helps you out, um, especially if you're going a PVE route on a free to play or light spending account. You're probably building hunter, and you should be wasting all your servant crystals on that hunter to help you in the PVE content. Um, very good for that. Um, Otherwise, PvP, kind of whale territory, like huge whale territory right now. So, mm, Kraken's the way to go on that, but usually people start off with Hunter. Um, if you're just getting a bunch of them, get what you want. But essentially, if you can get Shizuku, get, you go ahead and get it. If not, grab the Servant Crystals. Eve is not worth it. Me, you can get copies um, from the cafe right now. You know, same with Shizuku, but, you know, why not? She's really, really good right now. She's very important having having her okay these are the rewards moving on rewards you get your plain bottles and you get some corals or not corals you need corals to finish it but then you get all the way up to here so the goal for free to play light spenders is to get to this 200 to get this normal faction box which helps you out greatly every single month to try and get to that if not it happens i've had a count where i was just doing free to play stuff on it and i just want to make it so it is what it is just a reminder if you do not use your corals once the event ends, one wheel converts into two coral branches. And if you're at 198, and let's say you don't know if you're going to make it to that 200 by spinning the wheel, it's not a sure given. You can just wait for the event to end, get the two corals, get to 200, and it will give you the rewards at the end of the event, essentially. All right, next up we have entries exam. Now, if you're new to the game, or just saw the last one, this is different from what entries exam used to be, and there used to be one before that, right? It's had three revisions now, believe it or not. This is the third revision. I kind of like this because essentially um, 
you get to, I don't know how to say it. It's kind of a little interesting because when you do one of these um, exams, if you do them in a certain order, they unlock certain girls, which makes it easier to do the next battle, right? And some people were trying to go for high score, which was kind of fun. It was cool. So everybody can do it, essentially. So that's kind of cool. Also, um, it makes it a little easier, I think, for um, people to get admission prep, which is kind of smart. So the, only, the biggest thing that you just have to do is win one bet, because after, I believe, whatever, I don't remember what day it is, but it unlocks betting, essentially. Um, don't say it in the game, but once you unlock the betting, it's by days. You don't have to do anything. It just unlocks after a couple days. Um, you bet on, I think it's like five, if you get five bets over the week. If you win one of them, you get it. If you don't know what to bet on, ask in the Discord people like might have, I think this team might win, right? They might get some hints for you and might help you out. Also, passing the exams, there's probably going to be information on it by Sal. Thank you, Sal, as always. Hope you're watching this today. Um, kudos to you. Sal's great, by the way. If you want to look at his chart, amazing information for the game. He's got a link to it in my Discord. You can go there. He's very helpful. Very, very helpful. Kudos to that, man. All right. Moving on. These are the rewards. The left side is free. Right side is to pay for it. If you could buy 20 bucks this week, this is a good way to do it. You're getting a crap ton of capsules for 20 bucks. It's a great deal. One of the best ever. Plus, you get a nice little avatar right there. All right. Exclusive tasks. This is where you get the extra wheels. Uh, make sure you're saving every month for exclusive tasks to finish it off. Just You can look at old ones to see what you're probably going to need, but you're going to need four stars and five stars. Shards of stuff. Um, do not do these. These are a rip-off. Please don't, even for the plain bottles, unless you're a whale and you don't care and you have like 100,000 gems. But even then, I wouldn't do it. But it's up to you. It's good. Just do your thing. Next up, we have something new. A legendary skin in the game. Essentially, we are pulling uh, design samples, uh, random custom fabrics for each design or custom. Once you reach 4,000 custom fabrics, it will be used automatically exchanged for your legendary skin of the event. Your remaining design orders, design samples, and custom fabrics will be removed after the event ends and can be used in the following events. That's cool. Um, as far as rewards, I guess we get the, that is rewards that you can get. Kind of cool. Um, but uh, I don't know. You have to get 4,000 draws by 10 draw or no you need fabrics and random 10 design samples and a, a random number of costume fabrics for each design order consumed so i don't know how many we're to get but it says it right here as i say that it says it right here so what 0.001 percent chance you get four thousand right off the bat i hope somebody gets that i hope they just pop one and it gets it automatically that'd be great if you get that please post it in a discord or let me know in the comments That'd be awesome. Kudos to you. That would be so cool. I think I might do stream this week on Sunday in the morning at 9 a.m. and see if we can do that. Probably not going to get it myself, but it'll be interesting to see. Um, that you get a random. This is what you get, and of course, a random reward right here. Essentially, 60% chance of this, 30%. It's not even a given. You'll get 10 of them. So, yeah, this might take a while to get to the 4,000, but we'll see. Master design packs are right here to buy. Of course, it'd be to buy. Um, I don't know any other way we're getting these. Probably not. It's probably going to you're gonna have to just straight up buy, which kind of this is a pay to win event. <sighs> this skin better be worth it, and if it's not, well then we'll see, right? We'll see, because it's 160, and it's the limit of three. I'm assuming it's for five day a week, so you're gonna have to get it within that limit of some. You're going to have to get it at some point. So, we'll see. Next up, we have Lucky Dips. This thing comes around every so often, every month, so on and so forth. Um, whenever you don't use your Lucky Dips coins, essentially, it rolls on to the next one. It's a cool little event. You guys can get rewards. Um, these are the rewards from round one to six. Once you get the six, it resets to one. You can't go to two to three or one, two to three, four, whatever. You have to get all three of the rewards to move on to the next one. So, it's a nice thing. You're able to at least get a class set, a 10-star doll box, a, uh, capsules, so on and so forth. You can get it, it just might take you a couple months to get to there. Um, not that hard, there's tasks to do, you can get it for free, essentially. It says consume lead tickets, uh, get lucky coins from every 200 gems you, you spend. Um, well, one lucky coin for each three star above internship quit is finished, which is great if your monthly event just reset. Get one lucky coin for every 200 
uh, crystal chisels consumed. Essentially, if you're using your crystals to upgrade a that, uh, you get lucky dips for that. And for every rudder you use, which is a wheel, a limit of 80, you get one for that. So there's ways to get free lucky dips, essentially, and, uh, and slowly move your way through each round. Uh, next up, Bottles of Drift. It's always a good event to do, to pull for. It's kind of fun to watch. Um, the very first one we had was like on Easter a long time ago. Uh, I think it was a couple years ago the first one happened. It was great and fun. It was really exciting. Um, it's always fun to see what people get from just opening it up. Uh, as far as you could buy 30, limit of 30 here. Um, you also get these bottles, uh, ragged bottles, not plain bottles, I'm sorry. Ragged bottles. Plain bottles are going to be this one right here, and then this is like the decorated bottle. But anyways, the ragged bottles... Um, you get, uh, right here, opening up rewards. And then, of course, ooh, got a nice fact. Ooh, that's a nice box at the end. Um, opening plain bottles, you get this. Up to 10, 40 right here with that antique. It's not really that great. But, and then, of course, the decorated bottles, as you open them, you get these rewards. It's always fun to watch people opening up the decorated bottles and see what you get. Now, if we, we not, do we have a... We don't. So if you click in the game, you can tell what's in the what's in the bottles. It'll tell you. Essentially, sometimes they would post it here. Of course, here is these little packs you can buy. Um, this is not a bad deal to get extra stuff for the week. A lot of good stuff this week. Uh, this is a big skip. I'm not going to talk about it. It's not worth it unless you're a whale. It's on you. Um, old pack to buy. Winner Bridget. There you go. Lovely elite spot. Elite supply. This is a good thing to buy this week if you're going to spend a little bit. There you go. And of course, these things are the same. It's just um, bottles into this time, decorated and plain bottles right there. And of course you have a special gift pack and a special skin pack. Um, yeah. You collect the skin, there you go, like I do, and that's it for the week. The stream will be 9 a.m. Sunday, U.S. Central Time. We'll probably do some bottles of drift, um, do some Lovely's Journey, and talk about the legendary skin, see how it works, and stuff like that. So I hope to see you guys there. It's on Twitch. I stream on there. Link to that is in my Discord or description down below. And with that being said, stay safe out there. It's a crazy world. I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.